just across the Cumberland River from those neon lights of Broadway, we welcome you inside Nissan Stadium here in Nashville. All right, we're just about set for football. The crowd is definitely ready. So are we. Off we go on EA Sports. A good return as he takes it across the 30. First in 10. Play action. Here's McCarthy. Work in the middle of the field, but that is incomplete. A little backyard football here by the quarterback. It looked like he was running around the playground in his early days. The disruption of the timing early was the key, and from that point on, him and his receiver just unable to get on the same page. And that is going nowhere fast. Disastrous play. A big loss. What you love about these running backs, Mike, is that their confidence is that they can make every play a big play. But in this case, sometimes you have to know, all right, it's over. Cut my losses. Try to get back to the original line of scrimmage and survive to the next down. But tries to make this play extended. Takes a big loss. And that is incomplete. Remember what they told us, Mike, leading up to this game. They said it is so critical for us to find success, especially on third down. We want to maintain possession, extend these drives. Well, the first crack comes up, and they fail through the air, and we have to regroup and be able to have better success throughout the remainder of this game. No movement from the punt team. They'll line up to go for it on fourth down. Side. It's complete. And this will bring them all the way down to the 20 yard line. A nice throw by the rookie out of Michigan. It's going to be good enough for a first down. To the right side. This is Jones. And he'll get two on this one before being taken down. Look him up on a second down and eight. Setting up to throw is McCarthy. That is caught. And he's in. Justin Jefferson. Touchdown, Minnesota. Exactly the way they scripted this one. A beautiful opening drive, Greg. Able to find the end zone on the game's first possession. And Mike, the word that comes to mind looking at that drive is execution. And that's exactly what they talked about all week long. They wanted to come out early in this game and establish an early rhythm. And that's exactly what they did with that touchdown drive. 7-0 is our score as this kick is sent into the air. The return starts from the five. And with a well-placed kickoff, that's what these new rules can do for you. They'll be back up now to start this drop. At their own seven-yard line. Set to go now on first and ten. Hey, come on, come on. Yeah. Here's Levis to open with a pass. He's going to look for the home run ball. And his offense is going to be all set up with a short field and a chance to extend their lead. This is an area of the offense, Mike, that's going to have to find its rhythm now as this game unfolds. They talked all week, come out early, get some completion, settle down this quarterback. Well, in return, he throws an early pick. It's too early to go away from the game plan. There's a lot of game left, but this passing game is going to have to get on track throughout the rest of this game. This is Joe. And 
nothing on that one back to the line of scrimmage, and that is it. Defensive coaches preach every day, Mike, strong to the ball, get as many hats to the ball carrier as possible. And this is a great reason why. The ball carrier is able to make the first guy miss, but it was the pursuit from the rest of the defense that's able to get him down and keep him to no gain. Here's third and seven. Again, it's Jones. A game of 11 on that one. It'll be a Vikings first down. They run it once more with Jones. And he's going to take this all the way home. Aaron Jones. Touchdown, Vikings. Riker now to add the extra point. His kick is good. And the Vikings move out on top. 14 to nothing. Both teams ready to go once more as the kick's away. Here comes a return from the three. So now a timeout for the Vikings. That is their first. A fresh set of downs to work with. It is first down and 10. Like 54! Hand up! First carry for the man from Memphis, Tony Pollard. He'll work his way ahead for a game of about four. Here's a second and six. Levis. And that's going to be incomplete. The coverage was good that time. The contact jarring the ball loose and forcing third down. I like the idea of using the passing game to try to give your offense a little breathing room. You find yourself in the shadow of your own goalpost, Mike. Worst case scenario, you do not want to punt out of your own end zone. So I like the idea of trying to pick up some positive gains through the air. They've got to come up with some completions and try to pick up at least one first down. Or you're going to put your defense in a tough spot. That's the end of the first one quarter in the books. 14 to nothing is our score. We're back in Music City after this. Ah, uh, zero. They'll go. Here's Levis. Incomplete. They could get the connection on fourth. They'll wind up giving the ball over on down. in the NFL where teams are taking overly aggressive approaches. I think this decision even takes it to another level, Mike. I mean, to go for it inside your own 10, I love the aggressive nature. I'm just not sure how this is going to play out throughout the rest of the game. Look to hit him with a jet sweep here to begin this drive. And that is not going to work out as planned. Really a tough spot to try to run a play like that. 
Either way, it's blown up back behind the line of scrimmage. Pushed back to the 11-yard line for second and goal. A short one taken by Hawkinson. These are the worst. I, I had a couple of years, Mike, where I swear I got tackled inside the one-yard line 10 times, and then you look back and you're like, man, how many touchdowns did I leave on the board because I couldn't get one more yard. Now, for him individually, not ideal, but right now they're on the doorstep of the end zone, and they got to find a way to put... And he'll take it on in. Aaron Jones. Touchdown, Minnesota. His second touchdown of this first half. Reichard good with the extra point. And the Vikings will stake themselves to a 21 to nothing lead. Will Reichard the kickoff for the Vikings? The kickoff team is out on the field. And we're back to it as the kicks away. And we'll see a return here from his own end zone. He's across the 20 to the 21. That's where the drive will begin. On the ready. So they come to the line for first down and 10. Ready, ready. The tight end Okonkwo is in motion. That'll be intercepted. Picked off by Cameron Bynum. And he is going to bring this one back. A DB's dream. A pick six for touchdown. And they extend the lead. The defense joining the party. A pick six for a touchdown. Greg, they are extending this lead out. Yeah, now you've just seen both sides just make their impact felt here in the first half. The offense has done their part, and now it's the defense that is able to capitalize on the turnover and take it all the way back for the pick six. Both teams ready to go once more as the kicks away. This will be returned from the six. Now an opening past the 30. Nice job on the return. He's down close to the 35-yard line. Ready, ready. Here we go, here we go. Trap 60, trap 60. Ready. Now Willis. His pass caught. It's Chico Conquo. And he's taken down inside the opponent's 35. Willis to throw. We out wide and get it to Hopkins. A very nice open field tackle there. He could not get free. He gains nothing. Willis. He'll look Hopkins way again. This is also complete. And he's going to be dropped after a pickup of about five receiver just finds himself in a really nice groove and there's these weird times in the game Mike where it just seems like every ball comes your way every play they call you're wide open and you just find yourself in one of those grooves that athletes talk about so they got to continue to ride the hot hand because right now on that field there's no mistake in who it is he's gonna have the first down so they convert on third down with a pickup of nine from the gun, they'll give it. It's Pollard. And he finds a little bit of space. He'll take this forward for a gain of four. To throw, here's Willis. That's caught by Spears out of the backfield. That'll be a short pickup. That's not enough for the first down. Willis now to throw. Open man, right side, he's got it. And he's out of bounds at the five, and they're in business. It is first and goal. Offensively landing a lot of body blows on this drive, Mike. Just the ability to steadily march the ball downfield and remain so efficient, both Ready, run and pass. As they continue to wear this defense out, they have to find a way to end go. this drive with points. Anything short of that would be a bit of a letdown. That's going to wind up incomplete. Not much time remaining. Time for one more snap here in this first half. 
So as halftime looms, Mike, they have to find a way to capitalize on this drive right here and make sure they end the half with some sort of points. Now, that incompletion, not ideal, but at the very least, it stops the clock. Catch your breath, get back in the huddle, and this next play, it's got to be a gotta have it best play call. Nick Folk now on with the field goal unit. This about as short as you can get. Now, how about this? It's a fake. And that'll be incomplete. How about that call? A fake field goal, but it doesn't come off as planned. All right, Coach. Thank you. Two very different halftime speeches by these head coaches. That's for sure. As we get set for half number two. Very one-sided first half of action. Will we get a turnaround? Let's find out. The third quarter is underway. And he'll be brought down just beyond the 25-yard line. Ready, break. They'll come up here first and 10. Let's go now. The motion man is Boyd. And good yardage there after the catch. They'll wind up with a gain of seven on first down. Throwing Willis. Hit as he threw it. The pass is incomplete. For the most part, he's been very accurate with the ball. And he's completing over 60% of his passes, but because they haven't been able to get any big explosive plays, continue to push the ball downfield, Hasn't really translated on the scoreboard just yet. He'll try to run for it. Good awareness there on third down. He's thinking there's nothing there. Tuck it and head for the sticks. He's able to get the first down himself, avoid any big contact, and the biggest thing is he keeps the drive alive. Come on, come on. The tight end, Okonkwo, is in motion. Pass complete. He's got Calvin Ridley. On the ball now. 65 cat, 65 cat, 65 cat. The tight end Okonkwo is in motion. That's deep looking for Boyd. And that is incomplete. Tyler Boyd was the intended target for that one. And it'll be second down. Hopkins sent in motion. Off play action. He'll set up to throw. He bought as much time as he could, but he will finally be taken down. Third and long. Here's Willis. This one downfield for Okonkwo. And he's out of bounds in great shape. Down at the 15-yard line. On the stick. Bronco switch. Bronco switch. Set up. They'll run the toss. Here's Pollard. Lane fills quickly. Only managed to get this to the 14. Here's second and nine. Again, it's Pollard. And that one shut down pretty quickly. He'll get back to the line of scrimmage. Nothing more. Hawk 70, Hawk 70. On third down, they'll set up to throw. That is part of the three. And the Titans are going to have a first and goal coming up. They try to finish off this drive with six points. Pistol snap to Willis. First and goal. The quarterback thinks he's got a shot to take this one in himself. I think he's just a little late in his reaction and decision to turn into a runner. Defense has just enough time to get there. They stop him short of the end zone. Second and goal. 
They'll look to run with Pollard. So we'll take it to the other end as we are through three. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. They were stopped on second down, now third and goal from the one. Ready, ready. They'll try to sneak it here. And they are into the end zone for the first time today. Touchdown, Titans. Well, it's not going to be enough, but at least they find the end zone at the end of a hard week's work. Got this ready. will pay off with a touchdown, Greg. Mike, you can just chalk this one up in the column of too little, too here late. Give go. credit to this offense for not going down without a fight, but they're not going to have enough time to find themselves back in this game. And he'll get into the end zone and get this one a couple of points closer. Everything's about matchups, especially down here this close to the goal line. I think my guy is better than your guy. I'm going to put him in a position to have success, throw it up to him, and let him do the rest. Oh, oh. and he'll be brought down past the 25. Decent field position to start this drop. Here's first and 10. Play action now, it's McCarthy. That's over the middle and intercepted. And he's going to be taken down, but it's a quick change situation. He has set his offense up with first and goal. It's not often, Mike, that everything breaks right for this type of return off of an interception. But boy, is it beautiful when it does. I mean, look at the defenders just flip around and become blockers, trying to spring their guy to the house. Great athleticism, some great moves on his part. I mean, he's going to have some of his Man. offensive teammates looking over their shoulder for their position. Down to the four, it'll be second and go, goal. Go. Okay. 79, Panther 60, Panther 60. Throwing is Willis. That one is on beyond the pylon. Okonkwo, touchdown Tennessee. Well, Greg, the light's still on way down at the end of the tunnel here. They are climbing back into this one with that touchdown here in the fourth quarter. And they have a tall task ahead of them, Mike, but they have a chance. I mean, we've seen stranger things happen. They got a two-possession game here late. They're going to need a couple stops, and they're going to need a couple things to bounce their way. Even with three timeouts plus the two-minute warning, they're going to try an onside kick. The kickoff unit is out there, and they'll send this one away. Late in the game, this is where you see teams really start taking some chances. And boy, this was a big one, but it's not going to work out. McCarthy now to throw on first and ten. He'll be hit as he throws, and that one will wind up incomplete. Could not step into the throw that time. It'll bring up second down. Now McCarthy. That's caught by Jefferson on the right side. And they'll take this down inside the 35. Off Jones and a good run there. Going to get him five yards. Throwing on second down is McCarthy. That is called in at the five, and he will get into the end zone. Jordan Addison, touchdown Vikings. Now. A two-point conversion attempt coming. To throw, it's McCarthy. In trouble, and down he goes. So they decide to put the ball in the air, which I don't mind on this two-point try, but execution was just a little bit off, and it's not going to work out in their favor this time around. From the six, here comes a return. 
Oh, he's got room past the 30. Nice job by the return team as he takes it across the 30-yard line. The break the huddle. Coming up now Tiger, for first Tiger. and 10. Let's go. Willis now to throw. Two minutes remain in the fourth quarter. Greg and I back on EA Sports after this. To throw is Willis. He's going to put it up, take a shot for Hopkins. That one knocked away. It is incomplete. Very good job defensively. Stayed right with him and will bring up third down. Cowboy 80. Let's go now. Throwing Willis. He'll get this into the hands of Ridley. Complete. And he's down inside the 40-yard line. First and 10. And they give it to Pollard. And they bring him down inside the 25-yard line. The Titans will use the first of their timeouts. We'll get it with just under 90 seconds remaining. Here we go, Jack. He'll look to throw here on first down. That's over the middle and intercepted. Picked off by Cameron Bynum. And the Vikings are going to have it at their own 32-yard line.